We cannot start research today and come up with results three to four, five, six years later. Because then the world has changed and probably made our solution obsolete. My name is Jan von Brocke and I'm a professor at the University of Münster. I'm the Chair for Information Systems and Business Process Management and Director of the European Research Center for Information Systems, ERTSIS. In our new article in Management Information Systems Quarterly, we present an innovative method to conduct design science research. So design science research is a research paradigm that intends to contribute to real-world problem solving through research. So we try to accumulate design knowledge on how to solve real-world problems. And the conventional methodology, however, was very waterfall-like. So logically, it started identifying problems, developing objectives, how to solve those problems, then developing a draft solution, then to demonstrate it, and then to evaluate it and communicate results. We have challenged that thinking because we realized that innovation and problem solving is more fluent, is more dynamic, is more evolutionary. So also drawing on agile methods in software development and also in management, we have developed a new way of thinking and conducting design science research, which accounts for creating more fine-grained part solutions and intermediate solutions and to design and evaluate them along the way in order also to facilitate a more collaborative endeavor so that across disciplines and across regions and across seniority levels and across technical preferences in research, we can all join in together in solving real world problems. And this methodology we ground in systems theory and we have evaluated with expert panels around the world and we've conducted a design science research process ourselves during the past six years and the methodology is described in a way that researchers now can use the new development technology. Using the new design science research methodology enables researcher to be more collaborative and it also enables researcher to be more productive in that part solutions and insights and contributions can be packaged up and communicated and published to the community. And that third also enables faster progress of the community itself because it will be more collaborative and more adaptive to change. And we are convinced that such a new more agile way to do design science research is really needed, specifically given the speed of change in the environment, but also in the technology sphere. We cannot start research today and come up with results three to four, five, six years later, because then the world has changed and probably made our solution obsolete. Think three years back. Who has talked about large language models? which now everybody does. And this is uh, an ingredient to solutions, which is out there now. So we need to be able to make contributions fast and to embrace new technology fast, embrace new challenges of the real world fast. And so we need a methodology which supports researchers in that. And, and the new design science research methodology presented in our MSQ paper is the first to do so.